Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another video. Brandon Martin here. After I got done with uh, WWE 12 Road to WrestleMania Hero Story, so you can go check that out when you can. After I upload all three last three parts, but back to the video, I will say this: I'll be responding to your questions though, and I will get to answer it. For the Q and A part, Q and A number two, which will be, which will be this. And now, although I didn't do the, I didn't do yesterday's because I was just so out of, you know, out of it, you know. But but I digress. Here we go. Let's go ahead and go into the qu you. Someone, you guys, did send me some questions, so that's a plus for that. Thank you very much for sending me questions. And I'll go ahead and answer your questions right now. We got questions from my good friend David St. Dennis, or a.k.a. David3000. And he, he has five questions asking me, saying this. First of all is this. Are you planning to do any upcoming game show series on your channel? Well, I know it's been a long time since I've been doing gameplays, game show series. I know, I know it's been a long time since I've been doing a game show series, since over a year. And the last one I did was Joker's Wild. We'll see if I can do a game show series, like for the for this. But we'll see what happens from there on out when I get the time to do so. But for the second question he asked me is this. Besides WWE games, what other gameplays are you planning to do? Hmm. Ah, uh, well, I might be planning on doing UFC 4. That will be, will be a, a new gameplay I will do for the next series if that comes in play. And I will do that for sure. I'll go, I'll, I'll say UFC 4. And third question, he says this. Uh, David, I freaking hate you for the fact. I freaking hate you. Are you going to do plush videos like Monkey Jordan? He <laughs> he. Uh, that's a definitely a hell no on that one. So that's not happening. And the fourth question he asked me is this. Are you... Okay. Ugh, let me try it again. Any other special plans for your channel for hitting 1,000 subscribers? Or even just anything in general for a special occasion? Well. I'll say since we already... Already did a special for Rant Rate Podcast, though. For episode number 41, which I did that, so... Any other special, any other plans that I can do for 1K? <sighs> mm, well, not right now at the moment. I'm just, like I did, I did the special for Rank Ray for, for the 1,000 subscribers on my end, so. Not that I really know of. Anyway, for the fifth and final question David asked me is this. Will you ever do vlog videos on your page? S especially... It, he put, especially when the pandemic is over. <sighs> That's a good question. I will, definitely. I mean, if it's like a wrestling vlog, then I will. Even though, with, you know, if I go to a wrestling match, <sighs> probably not this year because the pandemic and all that bull crap. I will say, you know, come next year, you know, I will be able to do that, you know, gonna go to, you know, I might be planning on trips uh, and all that for next, for this coming, for this year, for next year, actually, excuse me, but we'll see what happens from there. Okay, we got a, we got another question this time from Your Antics, form, or my good friend uh, Connor, saying this, why did you start doing YouTube? Well, that's actually good, very good question. Well, why did I start? Why did I start? 
why did I start doing YouTube? Well, well, since I was like 12 years, since I was like 12 years old at the time, it was like 20, 2011, mid July of 2011, I started doing a YouTube channel, just my old name called Brand91724. It was good and all that, but then some, some shocking, you know, got me and some, you know, some big doo doo, which, you know, I'm not going to go into further detail for that. I was young and all that other stuff. Then I went into another, which is the Mr. W Fan 2013. I was into that too, but unfortunately, some things didn't go in favor as well. Didn't know what the hell happened. My password was and all that, but but came to my channel just my my name Brandon Martin. Still going strong. Five years. Ever since I started YouTube back in July of 2011. Nine years I've been doing this. Next year I'll be going into my 10th year. So I'll be very excited for that as well. And, uh, you know, it'll be an honor to do this. You know, 10 years being on YouTube. And then February, I'll be going into my sixth year for the channel. Very, very excited for that. Well, yeah, thank you for your question there, Connor. And the next one, I'm not going to mention that certain individual, which was not a question, just, just saying congrats on the 1,000 subscribers. But for the real questions, my good friends, my good friend for a very long time, Billy Moody, asked me six, gonna ask me six questions this time. First one he asked, among the WWE games you have, which one is your favorite? I know it sure as hell ain't WW2K20. F that game. It probably sucks. You know what? But anyway, but beyond going back into your question there, uh, beyond the serious note, my favorite WWE game, I will say, is SmackDown. Shut your mouth. Great game, you know. But I'll plan on doing a series for that when I get when when I get to that as well after I get done with you know every other thing. But I will just say this for the record, you know I'll be ready, and I'll be ready when it, when the time comes and all that. And yeah. Second question you asked me is, what was your favorite WCW show to watch back in the day? Although I didn't watch WCW back, you know, when I was young, I was was watching a wrestling fan at that time, you know. If I have to answer, if I get to answer that question, I would have gone for a WCW Monday Nitro. That would be my, that would be the question that you asked me. So I go with WCW Monday Nitro. Next one he asked me, what was your favorite ECW match? It, are you talking about the original ECW or the uh, WWE ECW? I'll go either or, but I'll go with the, I'm going to, you know, I go with the original ECW for the fact. I love it. And I'm going to go with Sabu versus Taz, Barry Legal, 1997. Great matchup. No, I mean, although it wasn't extreme and all that, you at least expect, but one of my favorite matches I go with is Sabu versus Taz, Barry Legal, 1997. All right. Next one. He's next one. He asked me is, "What was your favorite WrestleMania pay-per-view?" Oh boy. 
I have to go with WrestleMania 21. Why do I go for that? Well, because I know WrestleMania 21, they had a good one, two good matches was Kurt Angle versus Shawn Michaels. Very good match to see. Uh, and also, I will say, Batista vs. Triple H for the world title was great. Alright, here we go. The fifth question when Billy, Billy asked me is this. Among the designs in the history of the WWE Championship, which one is... Your number one favorite. Uh, well. You know, to be honest, I go with the uh, WWF title, so I go with the Big Eagle title. I go with the WWF Championship title. The Big Eagle. And the final question Billy asked me is, what is your favorite match you've seen Ray Mysterio competed in? Oh, uh, good, good question. Uh, well, I see a uh, favorite match I saw is I Quit Match with first Chavo Guerrero. You know... It was horrific and all that. It was great, you know, knowing the fact with Rey Mysterio. Been in the business for a long time, though. In Lucha Libre and all that other stuff. He's going to have a good career. Anyway, that's it for Billy Moody's questions for me. But anyway, the final question is from one of my good friends though his YouTube channel is Stray, Stray, Stray Bros which is my good friend Stephen D Davis saying he says this who is your all time favorite wrestler and, he, and then after that he just gave me the big compliment saying I love your channel I love the channel and all your videos you're the man well thank you Stephen but to answer your question my all-time favorite wrestler, I go with The Undertaker. Best guy, best guy been in the business for a long time, you know. Since he debuted back in Survivor Series in 1990, you know. Great guy, you know, although, you know. Undertaker has some great matches, some bad matches as well, you know. At least, he had a great career. So that's the reason why my favorite wrestler of all time, I go with Undertaker. Any, anything else from, like, spam, health review? Mm, nope, okay. So, yeah, that'll be it for, for the questions that you guys send me and if you if you want me to do Q&A number three just leave it in the comments below I mean and I will happily do a Q&A number three well that's it guys thank you guys so much for watching this video hope you guys enjoyed it I know I did and if you like to, for answering Q&A number two, please go to give us a thumbs up and please like this video, leave a comment. And if you're brand new to the channel, make sure to subscribe. And also not forget to tap that notification bell under my name, Brandon Martin, on your YouTube app so y'all never miss an upload or live stream. And also the hashtag road to 2 k continues on from here on out. And yeah, that being said, I will see you guys for the next video and we'll start on WWE 13 Attitude Era for part number one. So with that, I will see you guys then.